Hey guys, welcome back to my new video. In this video, I will share some secret tips and tricks about offset path that you can use in your designs to make it more creative. You will find offset path in object menu. Here, this option is disabled because we have not any shape etc. So first of all, I wanted to apply this on text. So go to type tool and type any text that you want. Now make it larger by pressing shift plus alt key and search for any bold font. I'm using Javata font for this. It's my favorite font. If you want to download, then check link in description. Go to object and expand this. Now I wanted to apply border on this. For that, go to object, path, and uh, offset path, and uh, set offset path to around 16 pixels. Then hit OK. As you can see, offset path is applied on our text. Swap fill to stroke. I want to make its border in one shape, so for that go to Pathfinder and make a unite. If you don't want to make with Pathfinder then go to Shape Builder tool and by moving mouse cursor you can make a shape, something like this. Now I want to make stroke more thicker, so make stroke more thicker and uh, if you want to remove this edges then go to stroke and make its corner round. As you can see a beautiful border is applied on our text, in this way you can add any border. Now delete this and let's go for second trick. For that go to type tool and add any 2, 3 or 4 alphabets like I am using AB. Make it bigger by pressing shift plus alt key. Now go to object and expand this. Hit ok. Uh, make it ungroup and select letter B and move it a little bit. By selecting drag selection tool. Select these points and move it to left. Now select letter A only and go to object, path and offset path and set offset path to around 18 pixels and then hit OK. Now keep it selected and select letter B also and go to shape builder tool. By pressing alt key delete this area. Select letter B and make it closer to letter A. As you can see AB monogram is created. In this way you can create any monogram. Now you can add any name here. Uh, like uh, I wanted to show you that how you can create this type of monogram. You can sell these type of designs on Shutterstock, Adobe Stock or any stock website. Okay delete this and let's make a pattern like in thumbnail with offset path. So select ellipse tool. And by pressing shift plus alt key draw a big circle around 250 pixels. Zoom out to your artboard and align it to center. Uh, now go to object, path and offset path and set offset path to 70 pixels. Hit ok. As you can see offset path is applied, swap fill to stroke. I want to repeat this process 8 times because I will apply these colors on it. So for that go to window and uh, apply actions. Watch this video carefully otherwise you will not able to apply actions. Go to options and clear all the recent actions. Make a new folder. Uh, let's make a name blend. Hit ok. And click on new actions. Add any name here and set function key to F2 and click on record. Now it's recording as you can see. Go to object, path, offset path and hit OK. After making this offset path, stop the recording first and you can play the action from here. Play it around 7-8 times just like this. Okay, now hide the action bar. I want to add the colors in all of these circles. So select these circles one by one and add colors. By using eyedropper tool, you can select eyedropper tool from your keyboard by pressing I. After adding color, delete all of these shapes. Select everything and by pressing shape plus rod key make it bigger. Something like this. Now go to rectangle tool and draw a big rectangle along the old artboard. 
I am adding black color in this so it will be visible to you. Select all the shapes and right click from mouse and make clipping mask. As you can see your pattern is created. I just want to tell in this how to use offset path. I hope you will like this video. If you have any questions then don't hesitate to comment below. Thank you.